Here's a value pack of frozen burritos. One weighs 0.238 pounds. Four pound burrito, glorious. You're allowed to take one bag of chips. I asked the cashier if I could take two and she said yes. This is the happiest place on earth. Here's the best part besides being four pounds. The wrap is a quesadilla. So it's just a bunch of different meals at once. Fries, quesadilla, meat, there's a lumpia there. Fantastic. Before I go to bed, I'm thinking about food. When I'm asleep and dreaming, I'm thinking about food. When I wake up, I'm thinking about food. When I'm eating, I'm thinking about food. When I'm at work, I think about food all day long. Did you know what a big girl eats is a trend on TikTok? Like they film themselves eating and what they eat throughout the day. I watch a lot of social commentary channels on YouTube, so I just found that out. What was even called what a 260 pound woman eats in a day? I only want to get up to 215 to 220. 260, that would be nice, but I'm stuck at 200, so I'll be grateful for 215 to 220. So if any food delivery companies, meal ready companies are watching this and you want to sponsor me, get in touch with me. I will put your food in my van. I will talk about your food all the time if you want to send me food and get me up to 215 to 220 pounds. I'm actually going to share a sponsorship offer I got the other day. I'll share that for tonight's video. But in terms of sponsors, there's only a few I would take. Seriously, I, I take a food delivery meal ready company sponsoring me, a Flying J pilot. I always say, Flying J Pilot, if you're watching me, give me $50,000 and I'll do a U.S. road trip and visit every pilot I can. The $50,000 is for food and gas money. So, Pilot, uh, rooftop tent companies, any rooftop tent companies want to sponsor me? I have a friend who wants to get into uh, the whole van life thing and he wants a rooftop tent. So, um, yeah, is that it? Get in touch with me. Send me your offers and I'll uh, review them. I've been getting offers lately. I got a good one that I want to share with you guys later. Anyway, speaking of food, I'm getting some food right now. Do you like ridiculous novelty big food? Uh, Picador. If you're in San Diego, drive down Picador Boulevard. Let me uh, lock this up. BRB LOL. Rolling in the tracker today. Of course. I got the club on it. My tracker is my oldest, most primitive ride. But I just really enjoy driving it. And of course, you gotta go parking OCD. Yeah, let me show you guys this place on Picador. There's El Picador Food Market. This is the place right here with the ridiculous big novelty food. When I'm walking to my car, I'm thinking about food. You know why it's good to park far? Not just to protect your doors from door dings, but when people try to park like at the closest spot, the cars are always cluttered. It's more hectic, so you just save yourself some extra aggravation and you walk a little bit. See, it's not too bad. I walk there. Get some extra steps in throughout the day. Look at this burrito. Just look at it. It's as big as three hands. This is like a burrito for a polar bear. This thing costs $17. 
And my rule has always been, if I could eat for $10 and I'm full or close to full, I'm happy. I could get three meals out of this thing. So good value to me for $17 because this is three meals right here. Let me show you what's in it. Here's the contents of this burrito. They put lumpia in it. They put fries, meat, and uh, guacamole. And here's the other section right here. So this is my first section, and then I have two more meals at this part.